Welcome to part 5. Trees. Step 1. Acquire some tree models. I use these. Press play. Put some trees in the scene to get a feel for nature. When you're happy with your nature, make prefabs. How? Make a game object. Call it tree. Put a tree under the tree in the tree. Why? Because when you create the prefab at position 000 with scale 111, the child tree model should have the right relative position and scale. Great. Now make a folder. Prefabs. Make a folder. In that folder. Trees. Drag a tree game object to the folder. To create a prefab, do it again and again trees. Now what? We need these trees to be in the world procedurally using a noise map. Open grid. Create a function. Generate trees. We need another noise map. Copy this code where we made a noise map, but it needs a different scale. Create a float tree noise scale. Let's go with 0 0.05. We'll also need another float tree density. Make it 0.5. Go back to your function. Replace this scale with tree noise scale. Now loop to the noise map. Ignore water. Now generate a random number from 0 to tree density. If the noise map is less than this number, that'll be a tree. But wait. What tree? Create a field. Tree pre prefabs. Now in your function, pick a random tree from your tree prefabs, instantiate it, set its position to that position, and just to spice things up, randomize its rotation and scale. Don't forget to call the function. Go back to Unity. Add your tree prefabs to the tree prefabs field. Let's see if it works. It works. What about rivers? Watch part 6. 